Hello, fantasy fanatics. This is Crimson, and you're watching some Bound by Flame. Now, I pick up where we left off, and we did pretty much everything. Apparently, we have a quest to turn. All oh, right, I forgot to talk to him about the uh, towers. I didn't even hit the right button. Way is clear. I took out the Dead Walker patrols, and my men are in position. Good work. We'll be able to keep an eye on the entire zone and avoid any unpleasant surprises. So we've done just about everything we could do. Every side quest possible. Didn't, well, talk to everyone about their backstories and all that, but, eh. Just about everything we can do. Uh, so let's, let's see if we can move on to the next area after this slowly snow adventure. I still haven't found your passageway beneath the city. It's there. I, I know where it is. Nothing new in the city. They still control the perimeter. If the dead walkers are aw I, I'm pretty sure they are. I'll be going now. All right. That's that last thing turned in. And uh, away we go, Edwin. I hope nothing goes wrong. Right, Prince? Right? Mercenary, I owe you my life. I'll never forget that. Uh, are, are, are we ready? We talk about the assault. Are you ready for the assault? There must be neither distraction nor setback. I like how I'm holding my we sword here. Second chance. If you have business to deal with, you should deal with it now. I've done all the business I'll do. Be intimidated by this. I'm ready. As I cut you. All business done. Yay, three man party finally. Chapter two. Reconquest? What? Reconquest. Well. Get to the city drawbridge. Away we go. Man, I finally get a three man party. If you're running around overburdened, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. Maybe we'll get some more, I don't know, uh, peat points. Wow, that's a weird engine. Recording device? What? Ah. Uh, oh, uh, I, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know if that were whatever. There's, there's a city drawbridge I need to get to. It's up here. I'm very distraught by what just happened. It's throwing me out of, out of whack more. Huh. Does that happen every time? Is that new? I'm confused. Well, set now. You, you keep keep a uh, noble watch there. Is it whenever it's accessing the drive? Maybe. I don't know. All right, let's see it. Let's see it again. Yep. Kinda. A little bit, maybe. I don't know. Two, two here. We go. It's very, very weird. Oh, we got enough frames to go around. Especially on a loading screen here. Yeah, yeah, you can upgrade skills. That was a very strange noise. Did I always make that noise? Man, I'm so happy to have a three-man party. Wish I could carry, uh, Sybil here, though. Or maybe, uh, Mathras. Oh, that, oh, I want Sybil because she's a healer caster type person. I kind of want Mathras because he's a powerful caster and, I don't know, okay for, for the jokes and the, and the humor and the wit. But... He makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> in many ways. No, I don't want to be poisoned. I hope Sybil eventually learns how to unpoison me. Then I'll carry her around forever. I like Edwin, though. She always has something fun to say. Is a useful caster. I don't know what this mind power of hers does, but... Seems to be able to paralyze someone in place. Oh, and I finally get to use this archer guy. See if he does anything. I think of three people, I think I can keep the attention off me long enough to actually get things killed. Or kill things. Either or. And again, I mean, it'd be pretty, pretty weird if I couldn't kill anything. Am I, am I not unlit properly? Yes, I am. But for some reason, myself being made of fire isn't a very good light source. That sounds weird to me. One of my vendors didn't want to talk to me anymore. I wanted to buy a cool sword from him. Or hopefully a good sword. Cool at the least. Should I even go in this way? And sprint, but I don't know what I'm carrying to be so overburdened. Well, I guess I'll level up my uh, recycling feet, and then I'll probably sort this weight problem out. So I can run again. It doesn't have any negative effects on the combat, so might as well. This one actually does. And I have less regen or something? I don't know. You've given me the same tip as last time. There. We have to head for that drawbridge. What about that other area in the 
Maybe outside of the camp that I can go to. Oh well. Do the drawbridge. I don't know what we're accomplishing from this again, but I, I think they know better than I do. Oh my, not you again. You were a boss last time I saw you. Hear me, sir. You see that boss over there? Although she didn't wasn't really a boss, she just had a big health bar. Oh no! I didn't have my hand on the block button. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. Purple guy with a ton of health who does a ton of damage. Dealt with. Look at them all be distracted by my multiple party members. I'm, I'm not sure what she's trying to do here. I mean, I have a harder time reading my own party members than I do with the enemies, and that's saying something. So I cannot read them. For the world. Oh, she's gonna slam down ice. That I do not want to be hit by. Man, I thought you were my ally for a second. Undead archer, dead walker, archer fellow. Well. This'll kill something, I hope. Ow. I walked right into that ice. Purple guy? No! Ow. That's happening when you're walking to ice too much. Uh, so I had an extended break, if you can't tell. And, uh, I'm getting very confident in my uh, new party member's abilities. Um, blocking is a thing I should do. That's very useful. And my spells. Forgot which ones were good. <laughs> well, they're all okay, I guess. Alright, so how do I want to approach this? Do I want to use my melee ability? Do I want to focus down, like, say, ranged enemies? Like this guy here. He's not a real threat. I can kill him easy. These purple guys. Whoa, wait, was it two purple guys last time? I think changing on me? Just weird in any way? What's she doing? She done that before? I'm, I'm so lost all of a sudden. Oh, there's archers over there. There he is. Oh no, I can't run away. Ah, uh, oh, ice arrows are getting shot at me while I'm over here. Oh, my allies are dead. And I managed to lucky parry there. Okay. Well, I would say I've been in worse situations. I think that might be true. There's my fire sword weapon. It's uh, plural. Aha! This might be where they come from. Oh, can I use the height advantage on my fire spirit? No, not really. Just down there. Alright, it's fine. I think I've dealt with the things I need to and reset them by running up here. I can pick up items while my allies are standing up too. Broke the game. Broke the game. Ooh, loot. I forgot what that sound was. I'm very happy about that, but I never will again. Daggers of thorns. Alright. So, just two purples and you, Ice Lady? I'm fine with that. Woo! No close for comfort. Glad that actually did knock him back. Did I put the points in that to give it the knock back on weaker enemies? I don't, I don't even remember. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure whether it actually takes me longer to kill one of these guys, or her. This, these, these purple sword guys, I dislike them for their health. There we go. Things are happening. Woo! Panicking a bit. Ow. For, ow. I was gonna say panicking a bit, for good reason. Alright, I remember this purple stuff, I figured out drained mana. Which is kinda bad by being put so many points into fire. All right, let's let's try to shotgun him. Nope, not close enough. Oh, well, maybe maybe having civil with me wasn't such a bad idea after all. Oh, I can do something in helmet. Wait, I don't even know. Now, oh, tooltip, tooltip, come back. Oh, lock on. That's what that button does. I completely forgot. Ah, oh, it's like my skills have frozen over. As if I had them in the first place. Let's try this again. Uh, let's get these uh, archers out of the way. And then we can deal with that away from her because they uh, don't follow me under here. And these guys are probably some of the biggest threats. I mean, she just did destroy me, but these guys have rapid fire. And ice damage. And don't stagger at all. Sometimes don't even attack. Now's really not the time for an. I don't know, multiple icy explosions. 
Oh, well, she's contributing. Are those are just me, or is it silly to have two ice casters fighting against the ice lords, you know? Why can't I get the fire casters? I suppose I am the fire caster. Still. You know, I feel like we could be doing this in other ways. Alright, so she gets stunned by that, so I could shotgun her, her and then get immediately destroyed. Should I be more afraid of that? Okay, it has a very wide area of effect. Worthy of fear. What if my crossbow then again? It's not. I remember. It was okay in the end. Man, look at that area attack. Oh my. Okay, can you guys deal with this? No? Oh no. Well, I... I contributed. And the combat resets again. Every time I walk through this little alleyway. Exploitable! Come on. You can do it. Or not. If I had, if I had a bow, give me your bow. Some arrows. You don't have arrows. Or kind of you do. Oh, there's your quiver. What? Your sword is beneath your quiver? In your quiver? He's a little silly. Oh, well, whatever. That works for him. Oh, do they? Oh, their health resets. What do you know? It's good to know. At least I can spend my time going one on one with these two. Or. Dying from an icy explosion that was nowhere near me. Well. There. We have to head for that drawbridge. You know, this is just gonna be one one episode of Ten Extended Break. You're just gonna die a bunch of times. But I, I will say this combat mix up of a, a big lady that I fought one on one last time. And then two of the purple guys in addition with two archers up here. It's pretty rough. Alright, so let's not even chance it and use our mana. So no you don't. Stay down. Oh, that seems effective. We can take out this guy over here, no problem. After getting our loot, so it stops ringing, of course. And I could use my uh, flame spirit to stun her. Okay, so knock, fall down, both of you. Alright, now just distract her while I kill these two. You can do that, right? You are fully capable of this. Alright. Whoop. Let's try that again. Sword is uh, running on fire. Let's refresh that. Can't see because of the icy light coming from over there. There we go. Alright. Now, Flame Spirit for the stagger. And just run up and shotgun her. Woo! Don't know why my fire spirit wasn't working out that time. It's fine. Everything will be okay. He's pretty much dead anyway for my one one There we go. Oh come on, whatever. Sword it is. Okay. Okay. We have learned that the fire nova ability is strong. And that ice can take about half my health. This isn't surprising, I guess. Still hurts though. I'd like to have more health. Uh, hear the faint sounding loot noise. I'd like say for a rock. Or an icicle. Of steel. Is this drawbridge? Hello, creature. Oh man, I'm so excited now. New creatures. We're not alone. What the hell is that thing with all those legs? It is a concubine. Lord Blackfrost has always had somewhat unusual erotic tastes. I'm glad you know this. Why would she be here? Unless she already knows of our plan. Curse them. Look at the support pillars. They crawl with dead walkers. A trap, and a good one. Your little friends will be taken from the rear, if you'll pardon the expression. Really? We must prevent it. We have to hurry to open the drawbridge. I say we must not. This concubine has given us an opportunity. We must attack her while her troops are busy elsewhere. These are creatures of great power. You must absorb them one by one if you hope to stand against Lord Blackfrost. Those other men are already as good as lost. A moral choice? Do not heed the words of this witch! If you do not open the bridge, all our soldiers will die and this war will be over. 
I do not believe you even have need of this misshapen beast's supposed power. This evil whore is twisting your mind. Why she both? wishes to weaken us. From the beginning, she has been hiding something from us, and it will go ill for you if you trust her. Really? I would have hoped for a little more affection from someone who spies on me when I bathe. Um... I don't need the power, but the elves are as good as dead. And I can ignore the... I, I want to... Uh, I wish I had a third option here. This sucks. So... The men are as good as dead anyway. And I'm, I'm assuming I can kill this concubine whenever I want. So I'm going to go with this one. I want to go with this one to, to go with the character roleplay a, a little bit more, but this this just... I, I can kill the concubine whenever I want, right? I'm, I'm not afraid of fighting two con... Uh, whatever. Romar's right. If we do nothing, those elves are screwed. So be it. Go then. Help your lost army, but remember that you have condemned us all. At best, you will gain a little time, but you will never have a better chance than the one that you are now throwing away. I'm not worried about concubines. <laughs> what? Are you betraying me? Oh, come on. I don't want to lose you. You, you had the best dialogues. Is this ultimately resulting in no change? Are you kidding me? Did I just choose between party members? What? I'm so upset right now. Or... Ah... Uh, I'm so upset right now. She was my favorite party member because I like what she said. I really do not want to lose her forever. But this plot development, I, I guess I'll just gotta stick to it. Ah, oh, man. Alright, I hope this staggers you. Ah. Nah, be staggered. Are you gonna explode into ice or something? Please don't. This weird concubine. Is this... Ah. So. Woo. Glad I ran away from that. To regenerate mana, at least. So I just sided with him to save more men, more doomed men. I mean, ultimately, I figured I'm going to end up killing the concubine anyway, regardless of when I do it. And I'm not worried about having a more difficult fight against her, which is why I chose this option, which I didn't think was the betray the witch option. Man, what if I was it an option to bring a different character? No. I didn't think it was. It might have been. If it was, I'd really recommend that. Uh. Take that. I wonder if I would have got... Ow, oh, more demonic. Didn't she just horse kick me? Ow, oh, I can't even block it. Ow. Oh, probably could have blocked that. Like so. Well, the parry always works, I guess. Woo, good stagger. Interrupt, I guess. Oh. Alright, I think you're close enough. There we are. Look at that concubine. I don't know how you move your arms around, but... Your power will be mine, miss. I will eat your power. Um... Uh, are you well? Better than ever. Then let us make haste. We must open these gates. Farewell, my concubine. Achievement cat. Man. I bet she would have said something clever and witty there. I chose the non-combat option too. Hello, city hat man. Are you another concubine incubus, or are you actually Lord Blackfrost? At last. Oh, hello. I meet the hard heads who resist the lords of the frozen shadow. Oh, Winters is furious with you, you know. He's most fond of his juggernauts. And uh, I suspect you may also be responsible for the death of his general. But you are mine. None but me dare lay hands upon my concubines. 
Not even the other Ice Lords. This is a lesson you will learn from pain. An eternity. This was my pain. goal. Hold on. You gave me three party members just to make me kill one? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here and be sad and run in circles for a little while. And question this guy's clothing choices and probably die. Thank you so much for watching. My hat is off to you.